excuse me, I'd like to open up an account. Well, great. What type of account do you have in mind? This kind. This kind. You said he was armed. He had a gun. You saw it. Well, he was also sort of a gentleman. He was very... What is up, guys? Kid Critic is back with another review, and this review is on the new movie, The Old Man and the Gun, which is directed by David Lowry and stars Robert Redford, Casey Affleck, and Sissy Spacek. Now, going into this movie, I didn't know this was Robert Redford's last movie as an actor. He may come back, and I honestly think this is probably the most perfect movie and story for him to end his career. Robert Redford definitely has the standout performance in this movie. He he makes the character very investing and you're interested in his character. He, Robert Redford also looked like he had a lot of fun making in this movie and in a way, I'm not going to say any spoilers, but his character, the way his character ends up, it, it's pretty emotional thinking about this is going to be Robert Redford's last movie, and you'll see if you watch the movie. Casey Affleck is also really good. I did enjoy his character. Sissy Spacek was also awesome. Her chemistry with Robert Redford I thought was really enjoyable. But I did think this movie did drag a little bit in the middle of the movie. It is a little bit of a slower film, but definitely, I definitely enjoyed watching this movie. I would go out and watch it, especially if this is Robert Redford's last movie as an actor. That said, guys, I'm going to give this movie a 3.8 out of 5 for Ernie's. Definitely a solid film. And look out for the next review. And peace.